Hi, this is Terrence Wing from Liquid Learn. I have a tip to share today regarding PowerPoint, and actually, it was something I just discovered too. And I figured it would be a great tool to share with those of you that do presentations with PowerPoint. Um, oftentimes, in presentations, we share the same screen on our laptop that we're projecting, and that puts us at, as presenters, that puts us at a little bit of a disadvantage. Well, the uh, tactic that I'm going to show you here or the tool in PowerPoint um, will help you sort of get the edge on your presentation skills. Now what it will do is it'll actually give you on your a separate screen on your laptop than what your audience is seeing being projected. And I'll show you a demonstration of that shortly. But first here's what you need to do. You go into the slideshow tab and then on the slideshow tab and I, I'm using a um, Office 2007 or PowerPoint 2007. Um, you'll see this um, tool right here called Use Presenter View. And in most cases, it's clicked off. So you just need to go ahead and click that box, and that puts it into Presenter View when you go to the slideshow. So now I'll go down here and I'll click my slideshow view so you can see what that's going to look like. So here's a slideshow view, and basically it's it's what you would expect from any slideshow. It's just simply showing what the audience is going to see. But now let's take a look at what you're seeing on your laptop. Voila! Basically, this is showing you what the audience is seeing on their screen. It doesn't show the animations, but it does let you at least see the overall uh, image that's going to be showing up. Now, in the notes, uh, the notes page or the notes section on PowerPoint, anything you typed is going to go ahead and show up in this area here. So I can go ahead and type speaker notes on my note pages, and then as the audience is looking at this screen, I get to see my notes and the screen as well as some other tools down here I get to see what slide is coming up next what slide was in the past maybe I want to jump ahead a few slides and this gives me the option to do that so that's it that's how you'd use the presenter view on PowerPoint that's it it's that simple